receiver skills on that touchdown, keeping your toe in or keeping the heel in? Yeah, it's just something I'm used to. Um, at practice, I see Coop and them do it all the time, so I try to them them guys sometimes out there. Did you know you were in? comfortable? Um, I, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I Really, I just think I was out, but they gave it to me, so I ain't going to it. <laughs> you have good memories going back to Ole Miss. I know you broke a big... A big run at Ole Miss in 2011. Yeah, I'm, I remember that, but I haven't paid too much attention to it, though. I haven't really been thinking about it. Back in your tailback days. Yeah. <laughs> I know Saban said their defensive quickness gives the offense some trouble. What, what do you see from their, their defense up front? Um, they like to do a lot of movement, so we're going to have to be able to adjust. And they got like some quickness off the edge and got a big man, man DJ, right there in the middle. So we're going to have to be out physical to them this game. Do you like those short passes out of the backfield better or those ones where you're like running down the sidelines? I like those short passes um, out of the backfield because when I get the ball, nobody be there. Give me time to build up speed. But blocking when they can split you out wide on those, some of the screen passes you're out wide and you're blocking down on the screens. Do you, do you like getting those guys in space like that? Sometimes I don't, but sometimes I do. But it's, it's kind of hard for me because I'm not a receiver. So <laughs> I'll be having to adjust, and those guys be really quick out there. So it's kind of hard for me sometimes. Mm -hmm. you, I know you asked about this a lot. Too. Did you ever imagine you'd have to seven touchdown catches like yeah. in your Alabama career? Nah, I just thought I was going to be a running back. <laughs> <laughs> Do you like this role? I mean, you seem like you've kind of found a niche here on the team, though. Yeah, I love the role. I mean, it give me a chance to get, get out there and show, showcase my skills and show the world what I can do and help the team win. You know that Lane Kiffin's brother is the defensive line coach at Ole Miss? Nah, I didn't know that. didn't know that. It's like you haven't got any intel yet, I guess. Nah, he gonna, I, probably, I know he's going to be pumping them up all week, telling me we got to stop my brother offense. <laughs> <laughs> Anything else for me? How tough of a venue was that? Was the, the play at Ole Miss, just how tough is it? I mean, it's going to be pretty tough. I mean, recently I, I don't remember going back to Ole Miss. I, mean, I don't remember it being like a big, scary place to play in, but it's, I know it's going to be pretty loud up in there. Just, yeah. Will it make it tougher for the offense to do with some up-tempo stuff, playing on the road in general? Nah, once you learn the signal, it, it becomes all easy to you. Have you always had good hands? Yes, yeah, always. <laughs> <laughs> I always, I'm, I remember just growing up in the project, just going around playing catch with everybody. Just like you stay in one part of the neighborhood, you got friends on the other side, you're going to play against them. So everybody used to pick me because I could catch. Because <laughs> <laughs> you were just bigger than everybody? Yeah, that too. <laughs> <laughs> what, what do you think of your best catch of your, your career here has been? Uh, the one I just made in the recent game. And the one that takes a hand them for the win, to seal the win. Those are the two biggest ones for me. Just from what you saw last week, how's Blake looking? How's his shoulder looking? Um, Blake looked good. He's doing great. I mean, we're just going to keep pushing him and making him more confident out there. So he, he should be all right. Anything else? Thanks, guys. Thanks, Thanks Appreciate it.